All right, 200 subscribers. I uh, want to thank everybody who's been following my channel. I know most of you follow it because of my Street Fighter 4 videos, especially my hard trials. And I want to say thanks to all you guys and hopefully that they were very informative and helped you complete some of those trials. I know that pretty much they're the best ones on YouTube because when I have troubles with a hard trial that I do over again because I do them on different systems, I go to my own videos because they're the most helpful. You know, I, I just can't watch somebody else do it on the screen while listening to music. It's not very informative. More or less when I do my videos, especially near the end, I started showing my hands with the fight stick. I uh, started playing in slow motion so people could really see uh, what's going on. You know, it's a little hard to get you know, I've had requests to get views from behind the actual fight stick, but obviously I'm behind the fight stick. I can't really put the camera in, in between me and the fight stick, and if I did, I've tried it. Uh, my hands is getting in the way. You really can't see anything, but I'll try different ways to experiment to get better footage of the actual joysticks. I know you guys want to see better how that works on, on a fight sticks, so I'll work on that a little bit better when Super Street Fighter 4 comes out because I will be doing the same thing assuming that they have hard trials. So regarding that, I want to thank everybody who's uh, subscribed to my channel for that reason. And all my other videos, I have some miscellaneous videos, gameplay videos, just things that I've just been throwing out there just to see what kind of hits I would get. And strangely enough, my number one video is my Tekken uh, 6 video of campaign mode with Lars. It's got a ridiculous amount of views and I think it's got like one comment, which doesn't make any sense. But after I made those videos with Tekken 6, I pretty much never played that game again. So those who watched my video for Tekken 6 videos, um, you know, there's nothing really I can say about that. You know, I didn't get any feedback regarding, you know, you know show more Tekken 6 videos, so I didn't make any more. You know, views are nice. But if I don't have people leaving comments and saying good things about what I'm doing, I'm just not going to do it anymore. And that's how Tekken 6 happened. Uh, King of Fighters, obviously I couldn't do much with that because the online was crappy. And there's nothing in the first player mode that is even worth putting on camera for people to watch. And what else did I have going on? I did, excuse me, I did a, um, a little bit of a playthrough with Wolfenstein, which I pretty much stopped that. Um... I didn't get any comments on that, which is fine. I kind of wanted to just see how that would work. I never really did a playthrough of a game like that. It was tricky because I had it on the hardest difficulty, you know, and I'm not going to show a video of me dying over and over and over again in a level. I'm just going to show you a video of me completing the level on that highest difficulty. So you can see maybe some tips that, you know, you need to get through that. But that game's been out for quite some time, so I'm probably not going to finish that up. I didn't get much feedback on that, so I'll just leave that as it is. And I already mentioned the online on that. But there's really no point in talking about that game anymore. Now we have the Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 that's out. And I apologize for not having much on that, but I also didn't get any feedback on the Modern Warfare 2. I haven't actually played that game since I last made a video was the last time I played that game. I think I might have played it once or twice um, online with... Uh, with some friends of mine. And that was it. I, I stopped playing uh, Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2. That doesn't mean that I didn't like the game. Just I have too much going on and I can't really dedicate any time into it right now. But uh, the game's going to be out for a while and it's not the end of it. So I'll probably I'll probably pick that game back up again. But, uh, but just recently, you know, I have two jobs. I'm doing school full time and I have other projects that I'm doing. It's just really difficult to kind of manage it all right now. So I'm trying to find the best way to do it all. And uh, eventually something, something's going to click, and you'll see more content up there one way or another. Uh, I want to mention two things, as long as I can remember and I have enough time. One of them is Tatsunoko vs. Capcom, uh, All-Stars, whatever, I forget what it's called. Um, that comes out today, as far as I remember. It should be out today or this week. I'm going to be buying that game for the Wii. I will be using my Hori Fight Stick because I've had it forever and I don't really need to spend another 60 bucks on a fight stick to play one game for the Wii. So I won't be getting the, the Marvel, or the, yeah, the Marvel, the um, Tatsunoko vs. Capcom Mad Cats whatever edition fight stick for the Wii. There's really no point in doing that. 
I'll have some video footage of that game up. So I'm excited about that game. I just don't have time to get it or play it. So that might not be till the end of the week until I have videos up on that. But I, I will have some videos on it. And I feel like a lot of people aren't going to be able to play this game because they either don't have the Wii or they don't want to buy it because they don't have a fight stick. I don't know. Whatever the reason is, I'm going to put some video footage up there of me playing it, kind of like going through the game and see what it's all about. Because it's a fairly new game to people, you know, in America. You know, I mean, you could have gotten the game, I think, if you pirated it over or something ridiculous like that. But anyway, you know, I think it's going to be a good game, so we'll see what happens with that. So, I mentioned that, so hopefully by the end of the week I'll have something up on that. Another thing I want to mention is um, I started a website. It's one of the free hosting websites. I'm not going to pay to have my own website right now because I don't have enough time to you know, put into it or the money. And I'm not going to make any money on it, so it's no point. Um, it's called, well, on the top left of my YouTube channel, it's called thelevelgrinder.webs.com. I started to make that site at the end of last year and uh, just messing around with it. I basically want to make uh, a site with my YouTube videos on it, like my hard trial videos, so you can navigate through it better because YouTube site is pretty ridiculous when it comes to like how do you want the playlist to show up, and especially with the new format. It's just hard to find anything that I've done on my YouTube channel now that I have over 200 some of my videos. So I wanted to make this site and put all my hard trial videos on there. It takes a really long time to do it. I have a little bit of experience in web design, but not enough to be you know, that efficient at it. So I don't have everything up there, but you can go check that site out and just see what it's about. You know, you can become a member if you'd like. The, the member application that works with that site is a little funny. It's not set up correctly, but feel free to uh, do that. Eventually, I'm uh, going to do either a tournament or a league or something. I've done them before on Capcom's, uh, you know, dash unity.com, that site, that forum site. I used to go on there a lot. I've done multiple um, Street Fighter 4 leagues for both systems. They're like two or three per system. I've done tournaments, uh, you know, all online stuff. And I'll probably try to set something up for my site that people can uh, either log into. You don't really have to log into it because I don't know how that member member application really works, you know, because I'm still messing with it. But uh, I will do some online tournaments. I don't know. I'm not sure when. Maybe in the next couple of weeks when I have some time. I'll probably set like three days, three or four days, and just see how many people I can get. I prefer to have like 16 people. It could be anybody, any skill level. You know, I'll make up rules for it like I've done in the past. You know, just something to do. It doesn't have to be, you know, anything stressful. Like, you know, oh, you got to make sure you win or if you lose, you're going to be embarrassed. It doesn't really matter. It's just for fun. Because we all know Street Fighter 4, there's not a lot going for it right now until the new one comes out. I mean, online is it's all right, you know. But, uh, I don't know. It's something I'm going to be checking out. And I'll probably set up. I'll talk about it a little bit more. And, uh, let's see. Did I mention everything? Tatsunoko, yes. Um, did I mention God of War? I don't think I did. God of War 1 and 2 HD, not HD remix, but basically it's been redone in HD for PlayStation 3. I never played any God of War games until I picked up that disc about a couple weeks ago. I'm almost at the end of God of War 1, and I'll tell you what, I like the series a lot. I'm planning on, um, I might show some video footage of God of War, of the HD, whatever, uh, remastered version, if, you know, I get enough requests for it, but I'm not going to spend much time on it. But 1 and 2, that collection disc, I don't remember how much it was, it was pretty cheap. It's worth it, get it, if you like God of War. Um, God of War 3 will be coming out soon, and that collection disc has a demo for it which I've also played, which is also pretty nice. It's a, it's a lot of fun. Definitely a good game. So, yeah, I'm getting into the God of War series, so you might see something happening with that when the new God of War comes out. It all depends. There's a lot of other games that I'm, I'm really getting too involved. I think I have to kind of pick and choose what I need to do soon because I don't have the time to sit around and, you know, have my own thing going here, well this is what I do 24-7 is play games and upload them to videos all day long with some people. Won't mention any names. <coughs> <coughs> anyway, that's pretty much it. So I hope I went over everything. I'm kind of doing this in a rush because i got to leave like right now. So 
that's it. Thanks for watching. And stay tuned for some more uh, YouTube stuff.